Guy, welcome back with the with the charges and obviously over all, all aerobics uh, coming on board once again. Yeah, look, very proud to be uh, a part of uh, the sponsorship and helping out the guys uh, and the girls. Uh, of course, uh, all aerobics, we moved back in uh, last year, September last year, to a great new purpose-built facility. Uh, so uh, we've got them covered for their fitness and of course I've put on board. Stewie's got Michelle Michelle chopping on board, doing all the fitness coaching and, and taking the boys to another level, you know, giving them a really great base fitness so uh, with all the strength training and the cardio and yeah really preparing them well. And of course uh, you being around the charges for, for so long and being a long term sponsor you must be very happy to always get back to the sporting communities here in Hobart. Look most definitely you know that's what we're about you know whether it's a fun run or um, you know your local basketball club it's great to be able to support these guys and you know be a little bit a part of uh, preparing them and getting them ready to charge on into the season and hope, hopefully have success. And, and getting that base fitness, you know, being a part of that, you know, it's great to, to be able to help. And obviously this helps them, you know, become more of a, a professional athlete. I know I've spoken with the, with the coaches on how they need to change their attitude and how they need to change their, their kind of lifestyle around being a, a semi-pro athlete. Does being in a gym help with that? And obviously the, the crew you've got on board with personal trainers and that as well too, Guy? Undoubtedly, Ronald. Uh, you know, anyone at a high level, if they, if they want to do well at their chosen sport or whatever they do, it's, it's giving that commitment and it's not what just goes on on the court, it's all the preparation work around that and, and of course the skills work done, is done on the court but there's a lot of other stuff to be done and that's building that base fitness and, uh, and getting yourself nice and strong and fit and um, I've been watching The Last Stand recently with Michael Jordan, of course the greatest basketball that ever played and that's not even arguably but a big part of his, his was his commitment and uh, that ability to be able to just focus and do what he had to do to get the result and, um, and if these guys can get on board together and work out in a group, which Michelle's got them doing, um, it not only helps to uh, build that comradeship amongst the team but also you know, an overall base fitness that they need. And, and bringing Michelle on board here with the Chargers, and that obviously works for you guys here as well too as a, as a day job. You must be very proud of her helping out us here at the Chargers as a semi-elite program. Yeah, look, Michelle, she's one of our gun, gun instructors, one of our gun trainers, and she's a real motivator with the members. And, and of course, she's got a great love for basketball. Both the kids play, and um, she loves the Chargers, and she loves doing what she does, and that, that, that shows and it comes through. And, and um, she's good at what she does, and, and if these guys take on board, and that and a little bit of her rubs off on them it'll certainly help them help them with their season